This way, Kelvin, how can I help you? Hi, I'm looking to get my uh, grant that I was trying to apply for. All right, so you just returning the call concerning your grant money? Yes. Thank you so much for calling. All right, so, so my name is Frank Anderson, and I'm the verification officer over here. And here with the United States Federal Treasury Grants Department, okay? Okay. All right, so can you please just tell me what's your name, your first name, and your last name? Yes, my name's Samuel. Oh, how do you spell it? Can you spell it for me? Uh, S-A-M-U-E-L. Yeah. It's S as in Sam, or it's K as in King? S as in uh, Sam Snake mm -hmm. Studio. I don't know, S. <laughs> All right, okay, yeah, S is the same, I is an apple. Yes, it's Sam, or Samuel. Oh, Samuel. Yes. Yeah. All right, okay, what's your last name, Samuel? Uh, Gamgee, G-A-M-G-E-E. -E. Oh, just, it's Samuel Gamgee. Yes, I just wanted to know how much oh. um, the grant was for, because I need, uh, I'm really, I, I need to get a, a grant. Um, by uh, within two weeks, preferably. Because, no, don't worry. So if you follow the procedure, I'm gonna send you money by today. So okay, your false will be ready by today. Today, just, okay, that'd be good. Yeah, just okay. So Mr. Samuel, uh, you just get a call from this number concerning your grants when you just receive a voicemail. Oh, uh, it's a voicemail. Okay, so well, uh, before I move forward, can you please just verify me your area zip code? It will be the file as a number. Yes, it's 916. It's 916? Yes, that's my area zip code. No. The zip code is 916? Oh, the zip code. Oh, yeah, um, I'm sorry. I thought you were talking about my phone number. No, code. your phone number is 916-546-9600. That's yeah. the phone number. Yeah. That's the area okay. code uh, no, for I'm, my phone I'm, number. I'm looking for your area code. Your zip code, GS and ZIVA. Oh. Your file is the number. Okay, yeah, the zip code, um, yeah, 95814. It's 95814? Yes. All right. Mr. Samuel, can you please hold the line for a second? Yeah. I mean, just pour your false from the system. Okay. Is it fine for you? Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm thank you so much, sir. Yeah. All right, thanks for being hold with me, sir. And here we go. You're from Sacramento, California. Yes. Is it correct? Yeah, the, um, Sacramento. Yeah, uh, Sacramento, California, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm near the so state Samuel, capital. Uh, first, oh yeah, you're in the state and capital, right? Oh yeah, I'm near it. Okay. So Samuel, uh, first of all, I want to congratulate you for your grants money of $9,020, which you are receiving from the federal government as a financial support once in a lifetime, okay? Okay, yeah, that's what I was hearing about. I was shocked oh. about the uh, <laughs> opportunity that I was getting. Alright, the wrong answer. And yes, if even if I was to be called from the government and told me that I got qualified for a grants, I'll get approved for a grants of nine thousand dollar. Even me, I'll be sunk. Like when I have never for no grants, I would am just getting this huge amount from the government, right? Yeah. Well, I'm, I, I wanted to uh -huh. get at, at least five thousand, but nine thousand sounds great. <laughs> You, oh, yes, sir. Well, okay. the green summit, it, it will be never be a 5,000. It, like, it will be for like 10,000, 9,000, or more than that, okay? Okay. Well, is it is it 9,000 or is it 5,000? So it's $9,200. $9,200. Okay. okay, yeah, it's a green summit, which I could, will I be received, okay? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Perfect. So, sir, well, uh, first of all, my name is Frank Henderson, okay? And I'm the verification officer over here, okay? Okay. All right. And so, let me tell you how and why you got qualified for this grant money and why you receiving this grant money from the government, okay? Okay. So that you know the reasons why you receiving this grant money, all right? All right. All right. 
So, Mr. Samuel, well, uh, first of all, I believe you know that every year we the government conducts a demographic survey. So, last year in the month of December, we, we have done a demographic survey all across the state, okay? Okay. Yeah, I've yeah. done a so few the surveys online. Oh, okay. Mostly just online surveys. All right. Okay, don't worry. So, Samuel, in the demographic survey, uh, we have selected our 1,700 citizens randomly in different category, okay? Okay. Was it the survey I did on yeah. Facebook? or Because um, that's no, usually where right. I, I do my surveys mostly there. Or if it's... Um, yeah, it's a random, yeah, it's, uh, it's a random selection. We have selected 1,700 citizens randomly, right? So you have been okay. chosen randomly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so Samuel, yeah. Uh huh. I did. I, I do surveys all the time, and usually they they offer rewards when I do them. So I didn't know if it was a Facebook uh -huh. one that I did or. <laughs> all right. Yes. So it's a once in a lifetime opportunity to receive this grant money. As you have got qualified this year, you may never be qualified in the future again. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yes, so it's a one, once in a lifetime opportunity to receive this grant money. It's not only a PK grant, it's not a student, it's not for education, it's not for a college, it's not for a medical, it's not for a business. So it's a free government grant and it's a financial support once in a lifetime for the government to the citizens, right? Okay, so do I have, right. what, yes. what, do I, what, can I, mm -hmm. what, what do I have to use it for? Yeah, you, know, like you can pay for bills and yeah, you, know, you can like pay for bills and taxes. You can pay for bills. You can pay for uh, tax or like for your home renovations, for your financial support, any way you wish to, like for your education, for your medication purpose, as well. Okay. Okay. So the house. Like I was, anyone, yeah, I was anyone, curious anyone. if they did it with uh, so if I could go mm -hmm. use it for my house because I need a lot of repairs. Oh, yeah. Not a problem. All right. So. You, Oh, okay, yeah, no, no problem with that. So you can just use for your home renovation as well, right? Yeah, that, that's that's primarily what I'd like to use it for. Uh, all right, okay, yes, sir, no problem. Because I'm trying to sell my house by next oh. year, so I need to renovate and upgrade a upgrade bunch house? of things here. Okay, uh, so you just live by your own? Oh, no, I got my wife here. Oh, uh, you're, okay, all right, that's great. So, so uh, first of all, just let me tell you the process and just tell me your statement and provide you the information which you require to collect the green money, okay? So, as soon as possible, you can collect green money by today itself, all right? Okay. That sounds good. All right, perfect. <laughs> okay. So, so uh, as I was telling you that last year in the month of December, we the government have conducted a demographic survey all across the state. And in the demographic survey, we have selected about 1,700 citizens randomly in different category. So, like the people like who pay their bills and taxes regularly at the right time, and like the people who don't have the bankruptcy records, and like the people who don't file for any criminal records, and doesn't maintain a good relationship with the government, like a single parent, single mother, single father, employed, unemployed, retired, disabled, even a student, right? Okay, yeah. Yeah, just to maintain an economic balance of our country, we have done this demographic survey. And so while I do as a year or a taxpayer, as you maintain a good relationship with the government, so there's a reason your name and your phone number has been randomly chosen for the discrepancy money of $9,200 as a financial support once in the long term for the government, okay? Oh, yeah, that's, I mean, I didn't think those surveys would pay off, but I'm, uh, I'm, I'm really glad that they did. <laughs> All right. I didn't think okay. they were real, so but just, I'm just glad that yeah, I it's was a, it's to. a legit, so it's a legit man. Yeah. So, so similar as I told you that as you say, personal loyalty grants, you can use this grants when you for any of your personal use, like paying your bills, paying your taxes, paying your debts, all of your home basis for your financial support, anyway you wish to, right? Yeah, I'm I'm doing it for my home invasions because oh. I want to. Things I need to correct on my house. I need to get a uh -huh. new roof. I have to fix okay. my bathroom, and I got to do tile. 
are so okay. home and in, home invasions yeah. are probably the uh, thing I'm trying to trying to get for it. All right. Okay. So so right now, all the calls are now waking the line from the federal government. Those for your safety and security reasons. Okay. Okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All these calls are now regulated line from the federal government, just for accepted reasons. And the thing yeah. is, we are not authorized to ask any of your personal information or any of your confidential information on this regulated line, okay? Okay. Um, all right. Yeah, that's yes, fine. So don't um, worry. You're going to provide me any of your personal information or any of your confidential information in this regulated line, right? You said you want to, you guys are going to send it today. Yes, but, uh, you will be streamed by. by yeah, today. Just or oh, that's why right after I, I connect the I disconnect the call. I'm gonna provide you the call the number of my senior officer and your money approval account, okay? okay. Um yeah, I, I didn't know if it was gonna be sent to me in the mail. Because I usually get everything in my mailbox. Um Well also it's it's uh, yeah, yeah, let me tell you in that case. So, well, uh if it's supposed to be your application sequence we would have sent you a letter or your email box, okay? Oh, no, I didn't get anything in the mail for that. Um, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's the first thing for us. It's not your application grants. You have, you haven't applied for this grants money. If it's supposed to be your application grants, we would have sent you a letter, a letter, and, or your e email, right? Okay. So there's a yeah. It's. To non, yeah, it's a non-application grant, so there's a reason you're receiving a call, the direct call from our department, so that we can access you all the phone, all the information, and all until or unless you receive a grant money, you will be on call switch, all right? Don't worry. All the process will be done in a regulated line, okay, from the government. Okay. So that's why you accept the reasons. Yeah. Yeah. So, so uh, can you just describe a piece of pen and a paper? I'm gonna provide you the carbon number of my senior and your money. Approval kill, which is your money confirmation kill. Yeah, um, let me go, let me go find one, uh -huh. um, just give me one second, right now. Sure, just took a good time. Okay. <coughs> yeah, I got the, um, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm ready, I got a pen and paper here. Okay, so just write down your call by number, I'm a senior. Okay. Yeah, the call by number, it's 202. 202. 600. 600. 8824. 8824. Uh, yeah, it's 202-600. 0024. Yeah. Alright, yeah, I got it down here. Uh huh. So, so that's a copy number on my senior. So, um, do I need to call them or are they going to call me? Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. You need, you need to call on the number. You need to give us a call back. Okay, um, yeah, I, I can do that. Mm -hmm. uh, um, is there any information I need to give you when I call back, or what? No, you just need to, yeah, you just need to verify your name. Your first name Samuel, and your last name Ganji, and your money confirmation code, which I'm going to provide you right now, right? Okay. Yeah, just write down your money confirmation code, which is your money approval code. It starts with a letter. It's a letter K, K is in Kentucky. K. Mm-hmm. Up to then, J, J is in James. KJ ten twenty N twenty one zero two zero two zero yes one zero two zero okay. KJ one zero two zero that's your money approval account okay sir okay um yes so what you have to do is listen to call the number two o two six zero zero eighty eight twenty four and you just verify your fourth and, and the last term and your money confirmation card. K J ten twenty to the officer, right? Okay. Yeah. I, uh, 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 all right. I'll I'll do that right now. Mm -hmm. Then. Um. Okay. Yes, sir. So before I transfer your calls, I'm sorry. Before I transfer your files, I'm a senior. 
Sir, can you please tell me uh, how old are you at this moment? I'm 32 years old. Are you 32? Yes. Okay, uh, you say you're married, right? Yes. My, okay. my, my, my so wife what do you Rose. Baby? Uh, you know, you're employed or unemployed? No, I'm employed, yeah. I, I'm, I'm... You are full, you are for full time or half? Um, mostly full time, um, but I work construction, mm -hmm. so if it, if it oh, rains, if it rains, I, uh, I don't, yeah. I don't work during the raining days, so sometimes during, especially like October and December, I don't work, but, um, oh, okay. so mostly it's full time if I can, depending on the weather for, um, whatever I need to, to build. Mm, yeah. Oh, yeah, correct, exactly. Okay. So, so in order to collect your grants money, you got three options. The first option is you can collect your grants money directly, directly to your bank account or your check account. And the second option <laughs> is you can really receive the cash in your hand. And the third option is you can go to the Western Union, which will be a MoneyGram. So, which one would you like to go for? Like, you would like to receive directly to your bank account, cash in your hand, or you would like to go for the Money gram, which will be a Western Union. Um, wait, I, I thought I needed to call the 202 number and talk with them. Okay. So I need oh, to... another problem, yeah. So, uh -huh. okay. uh, yeah, I'm getting a little confused now. Um, do I need to call the 202 number, or do I need to go somewhere now, like you're saying? Uh-huh. Because I'm cooking That's right now. Right. Like... Uh, okay, no problems. Yeah, you can just call the number right now, okay? Can you just call the number right now? Yeah, I I, I can call it right now. I'm I'm, yes, I'm making some barbecued chicken right now. <laughs> oh, so, that's, um, uh, okay. <laughs> All right, Samuel, just do one thing. I'm going to hang up the call. Just I'll ca give I'll us a call but right now. The 202 number? I can do that. Um, yes. Yes. Uh, call yeah. the number right now, okay? All right, uh, I'm just really right. confused with, and with what's going on, but all right, I can do that. No, no, no problem. Yes, no problem. Just talk to my senior, and I believe they can better assist you. All right, I'll call. All right, thanks. Thank you so much. So thanks for your time. Nice to talk to you. Have a great day. Enjoy your benefits, sir. Congratulations for your grant money of nine thousand two hundred dollars. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm calling right, right now. I'm sure. pulling off the last drumstick oh. right now. All right, no problem. So just call out the number right now. I just I have to pay a false to my senior, okay? So they'll be waiting for your call. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh. Yeah. I'll call right oh. now. Or yeah. Maybe sure. um. Give me at least two minutes. It's not a problem, sir. Just take it five minutes or two minutes. Just two call, minutes. Give yeah. us a call. Yeah, I need at least All two right. minutes. Okay. All right. Bye. Okay. Thanks. Thank you so much. Yeah. Bye for my friend. Yeah. Bye. Thank you.